just for us. Uh, it's August 29th. Ronnie came home with a fever, and uh, you were connecting and playing. Yeah, we were painting nails, and the door was right here to her room. I was sitting on the floor, and she was sitting facing me. And I had my back towards her bed. Mm -hmm. And then the painting, and then we both felt something come through the door. David never really got into a lot of details of what was going on with Kamel spiritually or what would actually take place. He would more propose questions of, so if a, um, some kind of uh, spiritual attack, what would that look like? And then, you know, okay, cool. And then I, as I'm going back to painting my nails, I know where her voice is because I'm, I've been talking to her, so a voice higher than that. So I just feel like the height was higher than where she was at the bed. No, you didn't like the song. I'm like, Ronnie, did you say something? And she's quiet. And I look to see if she's awake or, or where it came from. She's like, what? No, I didn't say anything. I'm like, did you hear that? She's like, no, uh -uh, no, I didn't hear anything. And I came out, I would have told you. You want to know what I really think? Yeah, absolutely. I think people lean on the supernatural when they can't understand things that they're experiencing and feeling.